Good morning, Open Heaven Church. I hope you are all doing well today and are blessed in the Lord. You are blessed in the Lord. Today I want to talk about life. There's a Greek word, zoe, Z-O-E, that um, means the life of God. And many scriptures in the New Testament um, use that word for life. Romans 8, 6 in the Passion says the mindset of the flesh is death, but the mindset controlled by the Spirit is life and peace. John 10.10 10 in the Amplified. No, I think I'll read it in the Passion. A thief has only one thing in mind. He wants to steal, slaughter, and destroy. But I have come to give you everything in abundance, more than you expect, life in its fullness until you overflow. There's so much death being released and proclaimed in the world today, but the opposite of that mindset is life and peace. So today my focus is on life. In the original Greek, the word life in these two scriptures and in many other scriptures in the New Testament is zoe, Z-O-E. Zoe means the very life of God himself, the absolute fullness of it. It means a life that is active, vigorous, blessed, and full of vitality. And for us, I would add, it means being full of the Holy Spirit. The Zoe, the life of God himself, the life of God himself dwells in us. Romans 8, 11 says, the same spirit who raised Jesus from the dead is living in us. And he quickens us. That means he makes us alive. Thank you, Jesus. And as sons of God, we are partakers of that life. We're partakers of the divine nature. And we're co-heirs with Jesus. We who believe with him are one spirit with him. The life giver lives in us. And Jesus has given us authority to live from that place where we can release life just as God releases life. We can speak to dry bones, the dry bones in our lives, the dry bones in the, in the world around us, and release Zoe. The life of God is in us, and we can just speak it out to our families, our friends, our neighbors, our circumstances, and our nation. So brothers and sisters, you are strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. And I encourage you to stand strong in the authority that you have in Christ and by speaking and releasing words of life all around you. You are God's treasure filled with overflowing life. So be blessed this day with good health, provision for all your needs, strength and energy in all you do, and the peace that passes all understanding. Thank you, Jesus. May you grow in grace and more in love with Jesus day by day. Be blessed in everything this day. I love you.